So, um, I've spoken about blushing before, and um, it's been a problem for the last few years, but now it's uh, it's become more of a problem than ever, and um, oh, it's, it's uh, you know, when I had depression, I, I could hide it. I could I could wear a mask, even with anxiety, even with uh, schizophrenia. I could wear a mask, but with with the blushing, it feels like that mask is you, 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 that mask is coming off. You know, you can't even people know that something's wrong. They see you blushing, so I can't even wear a mask anymore. I'm even blushing in front of my parents. And the more I think about it, obviously, the more I do it. It's so weird, it's... It, it usually happens with just certain people. I, I can't explain it. Just suddenly, it starts with a person and that's it. Once it starts with one person, it seems to carry on. And I can be fine with a room full of... Ten other people uh, with with with. Sorry, if there's a room of ten people, I can be fine with nine of them. But one of them, every time I look at them or talk to them, I blush. And there's just no rhyme or reason for it. And it's so frustrating. Does anyone else have this to this degree? I don't want to go out, see people, talk to people. I can just feel myself burning up, and I feel so embarrassed. And it's not just embarrassing; it's uncomfortable. But the worst thing of all, and the most upsetting thing of all, for me, is that I started blushing in front of children. Because... Um, a few years ago, I was out with a friend and we were driving, I was driving in the car. I can't remember where we were, but we were lost. And... Um, we were on a street and without thinking, there were a group of kids there playing and without thinking I ran down the window and I said to the kids, um, oh, sorry, do you mind, do you mind explaining where we are or how we get to where, where we're trying to go and they were really helpful and I rolled up the window and I went on my way and my friend said, you should not have done that. He had a real go at me, he was like, people could think you're a paedophile. And that was a shock to me because I was like, I, I used to be a childminder. I love kids. How could how could anyone think I was a paedophile? Then, then that thought <laughs> then crossed my mind. You know, I when when I saw a baby on a train, um, I would smile and play with it. You know, now I don't look at it because that it comes into my head. You know, people could think you're a paedophile. And it's horrible. Fucking... It, it doesn't help with the media and... and um, that's not the media's fault. There's just a lot on, on, on paedophiles and, and paedophilia and it's... Well yeah, it's scaremongering. It is a media's fault, I suppose. They, they, they scare people. And now I'm scared that people think that... Sometimes I'm a paedophile. And and that, and it it makes me blush. In fact, I I love kids. They, as I said, I used to be a childminder. It was my favourite job. And now I've I've fucking mental illness. But if anyone's got any recommendations for blushing, then I'd love to hear them, because they're starting to ruin my life. I feel like I've shared more than, I don't know, uh, more honestly than
feel like I've said too much. It's fine, it's good to get out of there. Thank you for listening. I really appreciate it.